I don't think I realised until now just how great the voice cast for Bratz Rock Angels is. This is not the usual kind of film that I would discuss, but I want to take a little trip down memory lane with this one because I had the PlayStation game for this, or rather my friend did, and I borrowed it for a very long time as I played it a lot and loved it and then eventually watched the film which is about an hour and 15 minutes and I have to say it's pretty good fun for nostalgia. Now I, I should also point out I'm kind of just Bratz age. I was born in 1992. I was maybe 10 when Bratz came out so kind of just getting out of that doll's age but also slowly getting into fashion and things and, the, and Bratz really focused on that so there was still that interest there and in terms of being a short uh well, relatively short film I think it packs a lot uh into this and it's a lot of fun if you're I'd say a preteen. I think if you're kind of any older than 13 or 12 or 13 then maybe it's not for you unless of course you have that nostalgia it's directed by Douglas Carrigan and as I said the voice cast is wonderful Soleil Moon Fry voices Jade Tia Maori is Sasha um, Kaylee Kuoko is Kirsty, Lacey Shabert is Casey, absolutely brilliant, uh, brilliant voice cast there. And the narrative is good fun for something that I enjoy. The description from IMDb is one sentence, it's The Bratz girls take the stage and travel to London where they form their very own band. Obviously I, I live in London, I didn't live in London at the time. But seeing London in animated form is always going to be uh, a great thing. And it's always really interesting when an American production goes to the UK and the things that they focus on. I just find that pretty fascinating. The fact that they're forming their own band gives us a pretty decent soundtrack. And I have to say, while it's not the most amazing soundtrack I've ever heard, it's actually pretty good fun. And, you know, pretty addictive. The fashion, of course, is fabulous fun. If you, or I guess a ch if a child in your life collects Bratz dolls or enjoys fashion-based toys, you'll definitely be able to see this in, in these dolls. They have a brilliant fashion, very early 2000s, you know, this is 2005. Um, but the one thing I will say is that the quality, the, the CGI is not incredible it's kind of like it's like they've turned the video game into a film I don't know if that what I've just said makes sense but you know how you know CGI based films from 2005 generally are not that bad but PlayStation games from 2005 still had not the crispest or sharpest of graphics and it's like they've taken the computer graphics and just made it into a film now, I don't know that much about how CGI works compared to live action or animation. But I, you know, I thought they would have been able to achieve something a little bit better to look at, something a bit easier on the eye. But it's not so bad that it's not enjoyable. It's good fun. I think the fact that they're called rock angels gives them a little bit of an edge. You know, they're not just overly feminine like Barbie not that I'm saying I prefer Bratz to Barbie. Not that I'm saying I like either. I'm 29. But growing up, certainly, I was a, a Barbie Barbie fan. But in terms of the actual film, if you compare this to the Barbie films, this is a lot more inspirational for children than Barbie. It's a bit more realistic. It's about actually giving characters personalities and a sense of style, a sense of individuality. Barbie films are usually about princesses and ponies. So in that sense, this is actually a little bit more just worth of watch, I guess, safer, more realistic. I like it for nostalgia. It's good fun to watch it, to look back and think, yeah, this was, this was a fun time in my life. Obviously, for an adult, you're not going to get anything out of it. But if you have you know, young children or you know young children who are into the brats, I think this is a pretty good one to watch. Uh, and I think it's one that you'll get a lot out of. Bratz Rock Angels is a PlayStation game. Absolutely loved it. And as a film, for the age range, it's actually pretty okay. <laughs>